Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're saddling up for a nostalgic ride through the dusty trails of the early 2000s with the film, Cowboy Up. Released in 2001, this rodeo drama roped in an ensemble cast, featuring some familiar faces that left an indelible mark on the cinematic landscape. But where are our favorite cowboys and cowgirls today? How have the years treated the rugged Kiefer Sutherland, the spirited Daryl Hannah, and the rest of the cast? Join me as we embark on a, then and now, journey to catch up with the stars who brought the world of professional rodeo to life. Kiefer Sutherland as Hank Braxton. Born on December 21, 1966, in London, England, Kiefer William Frederick Dempsey George Rufus Sutherland. Yes, that's quite the name. Would go on to become a Hollywood icon. Career. Kiefer Sutherland's journey in Hollywood is a tale of versatility. From braving rodeo arenas in, Cowboy Up, to saving the world as Jack Bauer in, 24, Sutherland's career has been nothing short of epic. Most successful roles. While Hank Braxton in, Cowboy Up, showcased Sutherland's cowboy charisma, it's arguably his role as Jack Bauer in the TV series, 24, that catapulted him to a new level of fame. The relentless intensity he brought to the character earned him critical praise and a Golden Globe Award for Best Actor in a Television Series Drama in 2002. Most prestigious awards. Apart from the Golden Globe, Kiefer Sutherland has received numerous accolades throughout his career, including a Primetime Emmy Award, a Screen Actors Guild Award, and a Satellite Award. His contributions to the world of entertainment have solidified his place as a Hollywood heavyweight. As of my last knowledge update in January 2024, Kiefer Sutherland is alive and well. Marcus Thomas as Ely Braxton. Born on September 15, 1975, in Santa Monica, California, Marcus Thomas ventured into the world of acting from an early age. Career. Marcus Thomas's career has been a steady climb, marked by a diverse range of roles in film and television. While Cowboy Up introduced him to audiences, his subsequent projects showcased his versatility. Most successful roles. Ely Braxton in Cowboy Up set the stage for Marcus Thomas, but it's his eclectic filmography that defines his success. From indie dramas to mainstream hits, he has left his mark on various genres, consistently delivering performances that resonate with audiences. Most prestigious awards. While Marcus Thomas may not have received major individual awards on the scale of some Hollywood veterans, his contributions to cinema have earned him respect within the industry. His journey is a testament to the idea that success is often measured not just in awards but in the impact an actor has on the craft. As of my last knowledge update in January 2024, Marcus Thomas is alive. Daryl Hannah as Celia Jones. Born on December 3, 1960, in Chicago, Illinois, Daryl Christine Hanna emerged as one of Hollywood's leading ladies. At the age of 63, she continues to enchant audiences with her grace and talent. Career. Daryl Hanna's journey in Hollywood is a tapestry woven with diverse roles. From her breakthrough in Blade Runner to playing Celia Jones in Cowboy Up, Hanna has embraced characters that range from ethereal to down-to-earth, showcasing her versatility as an actress. Most successful roles. While Cowboy Up offered a glimpse of Daryl Hannah's ability to breathe life into a character, it's her roles in iconic films like Splash, Steel Magnolias, and Kill Bill that have defined her career. Her ethereal beauty and talent have made her a sought-after actress in the industry. Most prestigious awards. Daryl Hannah's contributions to film have earned her recognition, though major awards have been elusive. Her star power and influence, however, extend beyond accolades, marking her as a celebrated figure in Hollywood. As of my last knowledge update in January 2024, Daryl Hannah is alive. Melinda Dillon as Rose Braxton. Born on October 13, 1939, in Hope, Arkansas, Melinda Rose Dillon stepped into the world of acting with an elegance that would define her career. Career. Melinda Dillon's journey in acting reads like a love letter to the art of storytelling. From her early days on the New York stage to gracing the silver screen, Dillon has portrayed a diverse array of characters with grace and authenticity. Most successful roles. While her portrayal of Rose Braxton in Cowboy Up showcased Dillon's talent, it's her roles in classic films like Close Encounters of the Third Kind, 1977, and A Christmas Story, 1983 that stand as pillars of her success. Most prestigious awards. Melinda Dillon's contributions to film have earned her nominations for major awards, 
including two Academy Award nominations for Best Supporting Actress. While the Oscar remained elusive, her body of work continues to be celebrated. As of my last knowledge update in January 2024, Melinda Dillon is alive. Molly Ringwald as Connie. Born on February 18, 1968, in Roseville, California, Molly Kathleen Ringwald became a defining figure of the Brat Pack era in Hollywood. At the age of 55, Ringwald's career has evolved from teen icon to seasoned actress, leaving an indelible imprint on the entertainment landscape. Career Molly Ringwald's journey began with the iconic John Hughes films of the 1980s, solidifying her status as a teen idol. As she transitioned to more mature roles, Ringwald continued to showcase her versatility in film, television, and theater. Most successful roles. While Cowboy Up marked a different genre for Ringwald, her fame soared with coming-of-age classics like Sixteen Candles, 1984, The Breakfast Club, 1985, and Pretty in Pink, 1986. These films remain cultural touchstones, and Ringwald's performances have become synonymous with the spirit of the 80s. Most prestigious awards. Molly Ringwald's impact on popular culture earned her a place in the hearts of fans worldwide. As of my last knowledge update in January 2024 Molly Ringwald is alive. Russell means as Johnny Blackhawk. Born on November 10, 1939, on the Pine Ridge Indian Reservation in South Dakota, Russell Charles means was more than an actor, he was a prominent figure in the American Indian movement, AIM. Career. Russell Means brought his passion for justice and equality to the screen. While Cowboy Up showcased his acting prowess, his activism for Native American rights and his leadership in the AIM added another layer to his multifaceted career. Means was not just an actor, he was a voice for the marginalized. Most successful roles. In addition to his role in Cowboy Up, Russell Means appeared in films like The Last of the Mohicans, 1992, where his powerful presence resonated with audiences. Most prestigious awards. Russell Means' contributions to activism earned him recognition, but in the realm of acting, he was celebrated for bringing authenticity to Native American characters. Reason for death. On October 22, 2012, Russell Means passed away at the age of 72. The cause of death was reported as esophageal cancer. As we wrap up our journey through the lives and careers of Melinda Dillon, Molly Ringwald, and Russell Means, it's evident that each of these artists has left an indelible mark on Hollywood in their own unique ways. From Melinda's graceful performances to Molly's unforgettable 80s charm and Russell's powerful advocacy, their contributions have shaped the landscape of film and activism. Which roles by these incredible talents have resonated with you the most? Are you a fan of Melinda's timeless performances, Molly's iconic 80s films, or Russell's impactful contributions to both the screen and the American Indian movement? Share your thoughts, memories, and favorite moments in the comments below. Your voices add depth to the tapestry of Hollywood history we've explored together. Don't forget to hit that like button if you enjoyed this journey, subscribe for more captivating stories from the world of cinema, and ring that notification bell to stay updated on our upcoming tributes.